Hi friends, and welcome to One Shepherd Ministries. I'm Kurt Risch, and today we're diving into 1 Chronicles chapter 24. We'll uncover how the division of priestly duties in David's time points us towards God's order and purpose in worship. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join our growing community, and you don't miss out on any of our regular videos or daily scripture reading. Let's go ahead and get into it. Now these are the divisions of the sons of Aaron. The sons of Aaron were Nadab, Abihu, Eleazar, and Ithamar. And Nadab and Abihu died before their father and had no children. Therefore Eleazar and Ithamar ministered as priests. Then David with Zadok of the sons of Eleazar and Ahimelech of the sons of Ithamar divided them according to the schedule of their service. There were more leaders found of the sons of Eleazar than of the sons of Ithamar, and thus they were divided. Among the sons of Eleazar were sixteen heads of their father's houses, and eight heads of their father's houses among the sons of Ithamar. Thus they were divided by lot, one group as another, for there were officials of the sanctuary and officials of the house of God, from the sons of Eleazar and from the sons of Ithamar. And the scribe Shimeiah, the son of Nethanel, one of the Levites, wrote them down before the king, the leaders, Zadok, the priest, Ahimelech, the son of Abiathar, and the heads of the father's houses of the priests, and Levites, one father's house taken for Eleazar, and one for Ithamar. Now the first lot fell to Jehoarib, the son of Jediah, the third to Harem, the fourth to Seorim, the fifth to Malkijah, the sixth to Mijam, the seventh to Hakos, the eighth to Abijah, the ninth to Jeshua, the tenth to Shechaniah, the eleventh to Eliashib, the twelfth to Jacob, the thirteenth to Hupa, the fourteenth to Jeshibiabab, the fifteenth to Bilga, the sixteenth to Immer, the seventeenth to Hezer, the eighteenth to Hapazes, the nineteenth to Pethahiah, the twentieth to Jezekel, the twenty-first to Jachin, the twenty-second to Gamel, the twenty-third to Delea, the twenty-fourth to Meaziah. This was the schedule of their service for coming into the house of the Lord, according to their ordinance by the hand of Aaron, their father, as the Lord God of Israel had commanded him. And the rest of the sons of Levi, of the sons of Amram, Shubael, of the sons of Shubael, Jediah, concerning Rehabiah, of the sons of Rehabiah, the first was Isaiah of the Isharites, Shilamoth of the sons of Shilamoth, Jehath of the sons of Hebron, Jeriah was the first, Amariah the second, Jehaziel the third, and Jechamim the fourth. Of the sons of Uziel, Micah. Of the sons of Micah, Shamir, the brother of Micah, Isaiah. Of the sons of Izhiah, Zechariah. The sons of Merari were Mali and Mushi, the son of Jeaziah, Bino. The sons of Merari by Jeaziah were Bino, Shoham, Zachor, Ib and Ibri. Of Mali, Eleazar, who had no sons. Of Kish, the son of Kish, Jeremiel. Also the sons of Mushi were Mali, Eder and Jeremoth. These were the sons of the Levites, according to their fathers' houses. These also cast lots, just as their brothers, the sons of Aaron, did, in the presence of King David, Zadak, Ahimelech, and the heads of the fathers' houses of the priests of the Levites. The chief fathers did just as their younger brethren. And that brings us to the end of today's study of 1 Chronicles chapter 24. We hope this reading has encouraged you to see God's hand in bringing order and purpose to his people, even in the details. If you found this helpful, 
please like this video and share it with others who are seeking to grow in their faith. Don't forget to explore more of our studies. Some are on screen now, or check out the rest of our channel for even more insights into God's Word. Also, be sure to visit our website at oneshepherd.org. It's new, but already packed with valuable resources to help you in, the, in your walk with Christ. Until then, stay grounded in the Word, keep seeking Jesus, and remember, we serve and follow the one shepherd, our Lord and Re Redeemer, Jesus Christ. God bless.